The unmanned aerial vehicle, UAV technology, has been playing an increasingly important role in our business and shows how Petroleum Development Oman, PDO, is embracing the latest technology for ENP business activities to reduce HSC risks in certain activities. Planning, surveying and risk assessment will never be the same again. PDO is looking at the latest solutions for surveying and mapping using unmanned aerial vehicles. There are many different types of these battery-operated vehicles in the market, from quadcopters to those fixed-wing types. Having fulfilled all regularity requirements from concerned government authorities, PDO has carried out aerial surveys using the quadcopter and fixed-wing unmanned aerial vehicles, UAV. This quadcopter, UAV, can fly up to different heights within the agreed limits in the country and withstand wind speeds up to 20 miles per hour. This battery-operated vehicle can fly for 20 minutes at a stretch. The unit is lightweight and has eight rotors to lift it and make it fly. Different types of cameras can be installed depending on the required output. For instance, a thermal camera can be used to detect the heat distribution around a particular object. The digital camera is capable of taking up to 24 megapixel high-definition pictures and videos. The UAV in use gives a complete bird's eye view to the operators. Now one can keep a watch on field operations, facilities and camps to highlight potential opportunities and avoid any HSC hazards. The eye in the sky has an inbuilt global positioning system and other sensors to keep it in place. It is operated using a remote control console. This enables its operators to monitor exactly what it sees and they can then decide what pictures or videos to take. Aerial photography by plane or helicopter is an expensive and logistically challenging option. We also be good work. With this new technology, we have innovative and cost-effective options. Be it redevelopment, drilling or construction of a new facility, a view from the top can help visualize and plan the project better. PDO has always embraced technology to improve efficiency and reduce risk in its activities. The use of UAS system has given PDO a technological edge. Now we can acquire high resolution aerial photos of the facilities across the concession. Current applications of the remotely operated unmanned aerial system. Flare tip inspections. Engineering progress monitoring. HSC maps. Locations overviews. Pilot view images for logistics high-resolution up-to-date monitoring, exploration footprints photography, support for engineering design and planning, outcrops oblique photography. This technology provides a different perspective to visualize and analyze potential hazards when it comes to flare inspections. The traditional flare tip inspection entailed the use of scaffolding climbing, or the use of baskets with lifting equipment. All these approaches were expensive, time-consuming, caused production deferment due to shutdown, and more importantly, imposed high HSC risks. The use of different type of sensors in this method creates huge amount of information that help to make the right decision at the right time and plan appropriate course of remedial action. By introducing UAV technology for flare inspection, the associated HSC risks are minimized and production is uninterrupted. The remotely operated unmanned aerial system has recently been in action across several concession areas, taking low-altitude oblique photography of the Amal Enhanced Oil Recovery Project, 
Hulud Fracking Initiative, as well as main camps and yards at Amin, Marmul and Fahud. The images have been used for a variety of reasons, including monitoring, mapping, planning, measurement, observation and exploration. I'm very pleased uh, that we are in video building in-house capabilities, both in terms of equipment and operator skills. This is mainly to carry out low altitude photography, uh, both for visual inspection and investigation of integrity uh, and filming as well. Potential future use of unmanned systems or unmanned aerial systems for illustration and production includes orthophoto maps, site surveys, as built mapping, service monitoring, both for geological services as well as uh, for other uh, environmental. And also these days, uh, our UASs have got multispectral um, sensors that could be used for emergency response, outcrop mapping, and oil spells. Every day brings on newer technologies and an unsatiable urge to learn and master them. In the interest of its workforce and the nation, PDO will strive and overcome every challenge and reach new heights.